These are the words of wisdom which queen mothers would say to potential minds of kings among our villages that raises, sustains, and maintains the children to live beyond childhood. In order to experience adulthood, parenthood, and elderhood. Therefore, beloved sons, I don't have any direct sons of my own, but I'm old school, and it still takes a village to raise a child. And it doesn't stop there just because you're older and may think yourself wiser. I assure you, as long as the mind, body, and spirit have struggles, then it should be receptive to counsel and encouragement without rebuttal. You are the presence and energies of cause and effects to eliminate physical unrest. You are own sons within the village of love, embraced near and far, while during your daily struggles for respect as a man among your enemies. Demasculinizing plan to ignore your DNA kingship reign, you still have potential and opportunity use your stumbling blocks and strongholds as a stepping stone and building blocks. To recognize your ability to know thyself is not without opportunity to experience the lows. So you can soar higher while spitting lyrics for justice like fire. Even I had to live as a fool first in order to become wise today. She wisdom Eternal Mother of Counsel and I wouldn't have it any other way to enable me to stand with wise words to say today. My sons, a fruit of my labor, you already have the internal power within. As the apple doesn't fall too far from the tree, as our eternal and everlasting parents, feminine and masculine energy, Words became flesh to prevail over wicked tactics of our enemies among the imbalance of humanity. Hypocrisy is as a serpent in a garden unable to walk among the flowered valleys. They are as a jealous god. They're full of malice down to the marrow of their bones, infused with fear of your ability to conquer without weaponry. Through the counsel of the cosmic, fierce, lioness spirit of strategic decisions to protect her offspring victory by fangs, divine words, and claw, anointed pen is mightier than the sword as it makes it lethal incisions unto the hearts of anti-melanin treason. To know thyself is the first step to recognize your problems so you can be receptive to the solution manifest your restoration in times of revolution among the colonizers artificial godly devotion while pursuing harps natural occurring elements pollution yet allowing your DNA fire to be the purifier you are still alive to be an answering prayer to a crown mothers elders life and children as it is written Knowing others is intelligence. Knowing yourself is true wisdom. Mastering others is strength. Mastering yourself is true power, Tao Te Ching. They are the continuation or elimination of our true to self-indigenous sovereign nations, life source, and eternal portal of intelligence, needing your protective force against the disagreeable our reign achievable. Them trying to hold on to our heel to prevent our elect's seal, to prevail all the negative degrees of energies over centuries with the principle of polarity tipping scale. We are a cosmic family essence to live beyond adolescence. For age is not an requirement to rectify this missing cosmic rites of passage. For what is absent in the flesh is present in the spirit. You can choose to ignore it, but I assure you will feel it.
gather in home streets or on the cops' brotherhood beats of secrecy. Discipline in the streets of the wilderness, the restoration reign of a sovereign fifth dimension, where our birthright entitlement is relevant. Hope your name is listed to a legacy of integrity, as mentioned when in line to contribute to this mission. Works of a conclusion of the free radicals' delusion of tyranny to usurp harmony. Our cosmic big mama's omnipresence, who knows what's best upon her breaths over this cosmic garden. Ageless and raceless children's stewardship responsibilities. As responsibilities bring accountabilities when straight away from being as wise as a serpent, but gentle as a dove. Observant and not a participant in wickedness forgotten by knowing good food when we taste it, but not wise words when you hear them. This paradigm shift no longer accepts it via just diets versus a life culturist. Awareness. How shall I counsel my potential mind of a sun king? Don't spend all your energy on sex and all your money on drugs, alcohol, materialistic girls, and sexual orientations of flipped wrist scripts of feminized men misusing their signature phallus. A key core to his gender significance of divine achievements and procreation relevance. When you are truly in need to be on bent knees is when in need and a desire for a mind of a wonderful counselor who reveals to you your power source and not contribute to you as a fault-finding discourse. We're in the time of absence of your mind of a woman's wisdom, helpmate, beyond the late night play dates, the unconditional internal noble flowing, growing and glowing spirit of your mothers or sisters or divine conscious chief fathers and uncles directly or indirectly, let's not get it twisted. For every king has a direct or indirect queen mother council advisor for a successful reign. Therefore, until you know the true one of wife potential, be it consensual to be of oneness, and focus and manifested leadership to bear fruit the seed of truth in harmony among the cosmic essence of rightness nobles. Don't think what comes simple is your equal for she knows she's the solar blood portal that's above being your equal. When their wombs determines the life or death of your sequel from below her navel. The wombman is the foundation on which nations are built. She should bear no guilt. She is the heart of her nation. If that heart is weak, the people are weak. If her heart is strong and her mind is clear, then the nation is strong and knows its purpose. For unfortunately, a lot of misguided minds and paths have destroyed minds of mortal kings and queens in this present time of eternity, in the minds of our divine cosmic mother's magistrate. She is awakening and repositioning a remnant divinely select elect without the wisdom of this world's degrees. PhDs, bachelors, masters, scholars, and doctrines among education rooted in pacified misguidance. For falsified education, controlled enemy alliance. To keep your enemies as the leader and you their follower. Now try to rectify this pestilence of self-appointed leadership, perpetuating monetary dictatorship for global dominance in the midst of a cosmic garden, free for sustainable and edible substance for our lifelong wellness. Yet our cosmic mother's infinite intelligence and omniscience will use her omnipotent divine feminine trinity, omnifarious, omnicompetent, omnipresent, to once and for all bruised the head of dominance and human rights insolence of indifference. They are the spark.
spawning seed of the fork-tongue serpent of the fruit of lies and deception. Our cosmic everlasting parents, energies, reclaiming back the minds of divinity and dignity, says we must have a transferring and a renewing of our minds and hearts' actions to put away your liquor bottles, drug pipes, IV needles collapsing your internal Nile Valley veins. It's separating you from your broad nose that is symbolic for warrior anger, for righteous indignation. As warriors for justice through divine discernment, close it from powder that eliminates your power. Even a small mouse has anger. Be the empowering choice that exemplifies a mind of a king, like King Randall and X-Boys, to be current, relevant, and mentor intelligent. Remember, the potter has power over the clay. When unfit, as the originators to expose the falsified duplicators. Then, it will be refashioned. There's two types of witness that is of great significance. You can be a living witness or a dead witness, yet your life will not be in vain. The choice is yours for your legacy to be told. A prop object or a judge and jury subject to welcome the judgment executioner victor. Let not the devices of entrapment entertainment not mature you out of adolescence, hindering the maturity from boys to men. For this paradigm shift comes with teachings in a swiftness. I advise you to walk as you learn and learn as you walk. If you are foolish, it is now time to become wise. And if you're immature, it's now time to become mature. For your enemies, agenda like them raw and tender. The great pretender is alcohol, altering your regal ego and integrity judgment to stay away from the defilement of your power of your melanated essence, and non-sacredness has altered what was divinely created, now has become unsure, and a life of wavering decisions and opinions. When you drink, you forget the natural fearfully and wonderfully made principles that govern you inside and out. To maintain a strong and fierce mind and body of defense for your home, village, nation and the soul of your unique divine culture. You are created masculine for a divine reason. Within is feminine attributes of what is absent in the flesh for your home and village community as a single parent. You can be a successful spirit guide by tapping into what is missing in the flesh present through you in spirit? Shall it be manifested spiritually, mentally, through reality's flesh, daily wellness? To be a protector, provider, counselor, comforter, and healer unto your children. Nevertheless, it starts with your inner me to guard your outer me uniqueness, knowing the counsel of Mother Knows Best. Her wisdom should last a lifetime of shared generational chaos and indoctrination turbulence for addiction. And malice is no place for the integrity palace, insolence which causes you to ignore the rights of the people in need. And the poor definitely ignored because of money religion, politics and attainments, by entertainment, video game addiction, 
is a major distraction, for your oppressor guilt is not without pleasurable glitch, as the adversary is awakening to his filth and dying existence of self-appointed institutions of usury, hypocrisy, religious indoctrinated dogmas, producing arrogance, callousness, violence, and injustice of exploitation of attended miseducation to eliminate divine restoration. For the adversary is in misery extended beyond the carbon copies of black and white treaties, where all nations drink of the cup of falsehood. And they who find pleasure in this behavior will get a royal chastisement spanking. Outranking their Nobel sadistic atrocities inflicted on the apple of my eyes, seed of the womb man. This wisdom reflects the light, a lie. It's still a lie, even if you believe it. Wait for it. The time is near to achieve it, as they scramble for the motherland and her daughters of distant sands. They scattered to miss the glass ceiling shatter, so let them drink and try to forget their hand of injustice trying to create another separate home to exclude the melanin skin, unless agreed to be their sadistic sexual minions, some lasting only for a minute as they drain the blood flow of the Nile from their bodies after being a malicious sexual party hobby finale. Yes, their agenda is the most defiled of all sins where this is the sins of the fall of mankind. The teachers of this character must be the sacrifice to the incinerator, leaving no duplicators in order for Mother Cosmos, Mother Nature, and the womb man mother, children, and corrigent over all nations reestablish the trinity of feminine wisdom in our activity. In this end of new beginnings shall all be complete. Now, activate your skills of spiritual weaponry. We have arrived. The Omniscient gives her hardest battles to her strongest warriors. Potential minds of Lion King's physical fitness maintains peak physical condition through exercise and territorial defense of women, children, and community requiring constant movement and exertion. Social behavior, lives and prides with complex social structures, forming bonds, protecting cooperatively, and mentoring the young together. Mental acuity, highly alert and resourceful, constantly making decisions about community, unity, and security, avoiding predators, and navigating their environment. Diet, varied diet, consisting them with essential nutrients and keeping your instincts sharp. Territory. Collaborate a large territory without borders to secure and explore, fulfilling your natural urge to wander and seal your domain. Caged lion. Physical fitness may not receive the same level of exercise as a free lion, leading to reduced muscle mass and stamina. Social behavior. Social interactions may be limited depending on the zoo enclosure and whether they share it with other lions. Mental acuity. While still intelligent, their environment may not provide the same level of mental stimulation as the wild. Diet. Receives a controlled diet provided by the zookeepers, ensuring their nutritional needs are met lacking the variety in pursuit of self-sustainable and sufficient territory, confined to a limited enclosure, restricting their natural movement and exploration instincts. Which one are you? There's still time for change. The supreme art of war is to subdue the enemy without fighting. If you know the enemy and know yourself, you need not fear the result of a hundred if you know yourself, but not the enemy. For every victory gained, you will also suffer a defeat. Like, share, subscribe.